Are you sick and tired of gambling your hard-earned money on Madden and 2K packs? Well, look no further than my sponsor, MMOEXP, for the cheapest and the most reliable Madden coins and 2K MT on the market. A link for their website will be right at the top of the description. And do not forget to use code FURTY for 5% off. Oh, we might... Oh, get it out. Jahashi. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's Jimmy Graham. In today's gameplay, we are looking at the brand new Gold 99 Josh Allen. So here is the NFL Draft Josh Allen. And this card right here is a nice little upgrade from his previous card. Definitely a really nice end game Josh Allen. I feel like this card does cover up a lot of the holes. Not all of the holes, but does cover up a lot of the holes that the previous Josh Allen card had. But the 99 throwing the run, I love it. The throw under pressure over 90, I love it. The accuracy stats, I love it obviously the base 99 throw power i love it the speed and acceleration i love it the fact that he's 6'5 233 pounds i like that as well but this card's one weakness is him as a ball carrier 69 carrying can't really juke can't really spin also the break tackle isn't that high the break sack at 99 though which makes no sense so you're telling me he has a 99 break sack but only an 82 break tackle how does that i don't know how that makes any sense but yeah, that is Josh Allen. I feel like in the pocket, this card's gonna go crazy. Also on the run, with that Gen 3 release, this card should feel like butter, especially with our ability set up today. So today for the abilities with Josh Allen being a gold 99 strong arm, we can use Hot Route Master. So I feel like this is probably the best setup for Josh Allen if you need Hot Route Master. If not, then I guess you can kind of adjust, but I think the 3 AP Hot Route Master with the 4 AP Gunslinger makes the most sense. Even though Gen 3 is already a really good release, I mean, you could run pass lead and definitely get away with it, but I just don't think it's worth it. I think I'd rather just run Gunslinger for just one more AP. I think that's definitely the move. So this way, Josh Allen, like I said, money from the pocket and really good on the run. Not going to have Escape Artist for obvious reasons, but um, yeah, let's just hop into the gameplay and let's see what the Gold 99 endgame Josh Allen can really do. All right, here we go. We are loading into game number one. You guys see our top three. And while we are loading into game number one, this would be just a fantastic time to head down below and hit that like button. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and turn those notifications. Um, we're trying to hit Madden 23 with a full head of steam, but there is still some business to take care of here on Madden 22. So hey, if you are new here, hit that subscribe button and turn those notifications. All right, here we go. Um, The plan I think today is, I mean... Usually I get myself in trouble throwing bombs early in gameplays, but it's a Josh Allen gameplay. I feel like you have to throw bombs in a Josh Allen gameplay. You can't be really hitting checkdowns. It's either you're hitting, you know, 30 yard, uh, 30 yard crossers, or you're throwing, you know, deep 50 yard post routes. There's really no in between. So we have the hot round master. Let's streak Vernon Davis. And by the way, the team has had a little bit of a revamp. I did add another 25 to the Jets and Lions team, and he's on Ray Lewis. I know that B was open, but that's that's my main read, and I saw Ray Lewis was kind of in no man's land. We should be chilling. Okay, is he going to leave X open again? Josh Allen under pressure. That was a great ball. Okay, that's what this card didn't have. Like, that throw under pressure, obviously a, kind of a big deal, but that's a throw that his 96 card just wouldn't hit consistently. And usually, especially with a player like Josh Allen, I would try to run the ball here but with the 69 carrying i'm a little bit scared to do that oh and he's easy he user no he wasn't user rushing i think he clicked on late i'm pretty sure all right hopefully he's still in man i feel like he's probably out of it now but you know second and second and goal on the 15 is going to be a little bit tough for us to score is he on to user Vaughn? oh get it out there we go elijah elijah moore touchdown let's go baby all right elijah moore touchdown good first drive for josh allen had that one tough throw under pressure but um yeah that was just a good drive i mean I expected this from this card. And even that may have been thrown under pressure too. you Josh Allen doing his thing so far. And I guess we can try the red zone high point here to Vernon Davis. I mean, it's not going to hurt. We can give it a try. Oh, he's actually was on Jimmy Graham and it scared me. Oh my. Okay, he was on Jimmy Graham and it scared me. But uh, we do get a nice fumble right there. Fumble from the pocket's a little bit concerning. Was that? I haven't seen that animation before. What animation was that? He was all over Josh. Look at this. He was free. And then, oh my. I don't think I've ever seen a hit stick animation on a QB before. And then he picked it up. Your Reggie White might be different. Well, I didn't get my both my quarters out there. I feel like he might do a good job here. Oh, he's running my play. This is literally my play. He just didn't... He didn't... That's literally the play that I run. I, th I just don't think he put the... Is he... Did he come out and spike? Yo, this guy might be on something, bro. He came out trying to spike the football. He's punting? Okay. Is that Phil Sims? Yo, this dude might be... He's actually punting. Okay. Probably the smart thing to do, but you just don't see that often in head-to-head. 
Ronnie Lott, go crazy. Hold up. Hold up, Ronnie. That's PJ Williams. Make, make a miss, a little spin. Stunt. Oh, he did it. He had a good click on right there. I tried I tried the stunt right there. He's on Jimmy. Oh, go, go, Josh. Uh, I might be able to go here with Josh, actually. Let's go with Josh. Don't want to get tackled with Josh Allen with 69 carrying, but we're, we're going to take that all day. He also did a pretty good job with the user, but you guys can see right there, even without the escape artist, you're still able to roll out with Josh Allen. I feel like if you're not going to run escape artist, you got to have at least, I mean, even with Fitzmagic, I kind of feel a little bit slow rolling out. So I would say you probably need at least like 90 speed to really feel comfortable without escape artist. With escape artist, it doesn't matter if you have 82 speed, you're still going to feel like you have 99 back there. But let's see that route tech from Vernon Davis. I'm a hit Vernon, man. I mean, I got to, I got to, I got to respect the route tech, bro. I got to respect it. Man coverage without pressure doesn't scare me much this year. But what does scare me is man coverage with pressure. Man coverage with pressure is just not fun to face whatsoever. Mainly because you're just, you, you like, you have to rely on your dudes to get open. And you kind of got to make snap reads. And sometimes dudes play man coverage better than others. So I would say that's my biggest problem this year. Just, we actually caught that. I would say my biggest problem this year is man coverage with pressure for sure but this dude isn't really sending much pressure and he's also running cover three with no you know with no zone drop so we're kind of picking him apart right now okay nothing's open i'm gonna go josh maybe yeah don't get hit don't get hit all right i want to try that high point but it's just jimmy graham and anthony Barr out there like it's terrifying to try okay we should get the wheel open free td you gotta love wheel route 22 man you gotta love it but barry sanders td okay oh oh oh, oh okay barry I think he's usering the dude I need to read, which is going to be tough to definitely do. Get it out. Oh, go, go, go. Don't warp me. Atta boy. A little speed option, and it is 14 to 0. And while we are on defense, this is a great time for the emoji of the day. And let's go with... Let's go with the... Pa there's got to be a pants emoji, right? Let's go with the pants emoji. Maybe the shorts emoji. Is there a short emoji? I don't know if there's a shorts emoji. I'm pretty sure there's a pants emoji. I'm pretty sure that's got to be my ball. But is there a shorts emoji? I don't know. Just comment some kind of pants or shorts emoji. Um, if you are watching the video up to this point and also if you're enjoying the video up to this point as well But again, you gotta respect vernon davis on this play It's so deadly this play right now with the one ap route tech because you've got to respect vernon Like vernon is such a threat out there, bro 90. Oh, we, we didn't get our feet in but wait. No. Yes, we did interesting seven for seven for 130 yeah, yeah, this card is fire man. This card is really like that. I feel like at this point of the year though Especially with golden tickets coming out you know, discounted abilities and, you know, baked in abilities are going to be all the rave to end the year because that's all that's really going to set a, set up, set apart a lot of these gen three guys. But yeah, I think right now, I think Josh Allen, great end game option. I think he's honestly fantastic. Probably user rush, right? He's going to use a rush with Vaughn. Yep. Okay. We're all over it. Did a good job. Pick it up. And another Elijah more TD. slot matic Elijah, another TD. It's about to be 21, nothing. I'm going to go for two here. Same play. Yeah. Let's go with the same play um we should oh never mind he made he made a right read on that wait oh maybe i i made the wrong read because i thought i was reading the outside guy but he was on the running back but when he hits they fumble man i will say that for sure oh we might oh get it out joshy oh no oh no that's jimmy graham oh yep that's we got deep out on randy though we got deep out on randy i don't care if you got jimmy graham listen i don't care because i didn't have a streak holding it he didn't do that again oh i should have journaled i should have journaled our ball to one yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to go out like this. I think I'm gonna have to go out like this. Look, QB sneak here for Josh. Am I gonna be fumble here, dude? Three QB sneaks consecutively should result in a TD, right? I mean that hole's clogged. Doesn't matter. Josh Allen's there. All right, guys. So that is going to do it for the Josh Allen gameplay. I do love this card. If you're a Josh Allen fan, have a Bills team, definitely a W. I mean this card can do it basically everything. Um, I would say the one hole is the ball carrying, but outside of that, this card's going to play amazing. And if you are watching this video later in the day, hopefully the rest of the gameplays are up. I am planning on doing a Saquon Barkley gameplay after this one, and then probably a Justin Fields gameplay to end the day. That is the plan for today's video. So if you are watching this later in the day, hopefully those videos are live. We also did drop three updated tier lists this week. So if you missed any of those, go back and watch those while you wait, if you are watching this early in the day. But um, yeah, as always, I will see you boys in the next one.